Hey tribe, we're here in the Chung Fu Temple again with Chung Fu and we have beautiful Madagascan black tourmaline here and Chung Fu is going to talk to us about it. Well yes, you know it speaks for itself, but look at the color of it, look at the depth of it, look at the, you could feel these wonderful pieces, you know, they, they, they speak for themselves, they're weighty, they're deep, they're strong, they're powerful, they've got that root center energy. But that's not to say you can't use them on the other centers. You can use them on all the centers because it's all about alignment. Alignment to the root, to the earth, you know, to your power, you know, to your physical, you know, uh, good health. You know, they're very strong to help you know what to do in the physical sense to really find your intuition about your health, your well-being, your strength, your stamina. You know, tourmaline's got a lot of stamina. You know, when you're feeling a bit exhausted, just hold some tourmaline. You know, having a few pieces is a good idea because you can put one on your belly, one on your root, you know, and you can hold two in your hand, and then you feel, oh, I'm ready to go. I've got power. So this empowerment of the root center, and then if you put it on any of the other centers, you just feel, I feel so grounded, you know, when this is, I can put it here and I can just feel how my, my, my third eye is connecting. It's, it's, it's very centered in that sense. It's not going to float off because this is, uh, this is rooting it. It's really holding its strength. So it's got a healing power and a clearing power. That's the other thing about tourmaline is that it's going to help you clear. You know, it's got a, it's got that magnetic drawing power. So you got a lot going on in your life. It's all a bit much, you know, you're just finding it all a bit, well, literally heavy. And you put the tourmaline on and it drags it out of you. It's similar in that way uh, to some other clearing crystals like shungite. It has a good affinity with shungite. If you have shungite and tourmaline, you got a real team there. So this, this is a powerful crystal for your root center to help you ground, stay very focused. It's going to help balance you. If you've got any problems with balance, tourmaline is very good to help you, you know, with, with problems of, of you know, equilibrium. If you get any of that kind of condition of imbalance, you could have, you know, you could have some tourmaline earrings made up, actually. That would be really helpful. But if you hold it or, or lie with it, put it on your head, around your ears, it's going to really help your equilibrium. So it then works. It, it is rooting. It is working with your root. It's also connecting your top centers uh, with, with your root center and that's how it's working uh, to help you gain equilibrium and that works also with thought so if you've got a bit of craziness going on you know you're a bit all over the place you know things have just got a bit much get some tourmaline because it's going to ground your mind as much as it grounds your heart or makes you just feel safe and secure it's got that safety factor to it so you can work it in any center, and again, uh, going to the mono crystals. If you got a set of seven tourmaline, you've got power. You have got a grounding energy when things get a bit much, and they can get a bit much, can't they? So, especially if you're sensitive, you're working with a lot of clients. It's good to put tourmaline around the edge of your 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 uh, sanctuary or your temple treatment room because it's gonna pull off which Shungite does, of course, as well. Mm. It's going to draw off a lot of that negative energy. And it really will store quite a lot before you have to kind of wash it or clean it. It's, yeah, it's like very if it was used in somebody's therapy room in that manner. Oh, yes. How, how often? Like once a month? Or what? But to clean it. Yes. It depends who you're dealing with. If you got a lot of, someone comes in, you know, absolutely crawling with entities, wash it that day. It, for general use, then you know, uh, probably more like once a week, really, once a week, just to just to dip them in water, 
Mm, just and with not. these dark crystals like tourmaline, obsidian, citrate, uh, sorry, not citrine, uh, shungite, you can just dip them in water, can't well, you? Well, the thing about shungite, you don't need to. Shungite is very particular in that way. It really is self -caring. Any other crystal would be organic, eucalyptus or lavender, wouldn't it? Yes, that's correct. Mm. Peace to you. Um. And um, Kali is the deity. Oh, right? the deity who works with uh, with obsidian, uh, with um, tourmaline. tourmaline is Kali, yes, and that's, you can understand why. You know, she, she particularly loves uh, to, to draw that negative energy out of people. And so the energy of Kali is very strong and is the overarching deity of Tumalin. Peace. And, um, yeah, so those, those of you that do come forward, and are interested to, in a sense, really make that investment in yourselves and experiment an adventure with having a, a mono set, like a, a mono set of any of the crystals that we've shown you, we are going to include a special meditation for using that set. But Chung Fu will work directly with us in that practice so it will be a, a practice for the public but i am going to make it a bonus that really is for those that come forward to take that leap of faith and, and work with a whole set of for example these tourmalines which are from madagascar what seeing as they are from madagascar what can you see that that brings because obviously tourmaline can come from India and Brazil mm. as well. Mm. Mm. Is there Mainly a... the quality, it's, it's not really, I mean it is about the place, but it just happens to be very powerful quality of tourmaline. Mm. You could get a powerful quality of tourmaline from the other places, and you could have parts where in Madagascar it's not so powerful, so it just happens to be a very powerful uh, tourmaline that that, that 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 they found here in in madagascar beautiful yes. thank you chung for you Lovely. it's an absolute delight and i can't wait to work with more of you and you know i'm, I'm working with you on the inside so when you get those crystals you know and, and you'll work with jerome myself we're gonna we're gonna go deep together peace chung Fu actually did bring us, which wasn't that long ago, uh, a course on crystals called Crystalline Ascension. Oh yes, so, and that's available too. Yeah, if you mm. want to know more about that, do get mm. in touch. Mm. Oh, enjoy it. That's right. It's, it's to help you get strong. That's the purpose of working with crystals, G1, is to help you grow, to evolve, to, to really expand your chakras and get connected to the divine. Peace, mm. G1s. Thank you, Changfu. Mm. Blessed be. Blessings and peace.